welcome back to the IBSP. Here's your host, Foxy New. Welcome back, Fight Fans. Welcome back. Eddie Reynoso has interest in training Andy Ruiz Jr. Let's just break it down honestly and objectively as possible. Now, this is a very interesting maneuver from Eddie Reynoso as showing interest in Andy Ruiz Jr. Let's just break down his exact comment when asked about Andy Ruiz. He said, yes, of course, we are for that, uh, to work with Ruiz as long as there's discipline, uh, that there's order in his training. And so he's open to a training Andy Ruiz Jr. And you know what? You got to look at a guy like Eddie Reynoso as one of the best trainers in the game. I mean, this guy has some of the best fighters in the game. He has the face of boxing in Canelo Alvarez. He has a young on the rise guy in Ryan Garcia. And imagine if he added Andy Ruiz Jr. He also has Oscar Valdez, just to name a few. So, you know, you look at a guy like Eddie Reynoso and you see that this guy brings the potential, the full potential out of all of his fighters. Uh, you know, he trains world champions and Andy Ruiz would be no different. I think that would be extremely good for Andy Ruiz to be able to train alongside these great fighters. I think it'd be fantastic for Andy Ruiz to be dedicated, to rededicate himself with a trainer like Eddie Reynoso, who's a no-nonsense type of guy, who's not going to let you slack off, who's not going to allow you to be a cheeseburger eating machine and you know it would make you come to camp would make you put in the work it will make you dedicate yourself to the sport i think that that would be a fantastic move for andy Reese and eddie reynoso if these two guys were to link up and look we all saw what happened with andy Reese last trainer he fired uh, manny robles um after the anthony joshua fight and you know what manny robles even went on to say that al Heyman advised andy Reese jr to fire him so, you know, that ended in a disaster. And it was a dumb decision by Andy Reeves. You know, he lost the fight because of his own inadequacies. You know, not because of anything Manny Robles did. Because he wasn't disciplined. Because he wasn't focused. Manny Robles is a good trainer. He got him to the point where he was, you know, a unified heavyweight champion of the world. So that was an egregious mistake on Andy Reeves. But if he felt like Manny Robles was not a guy who could take him to the next level, that's fair enough. And you know what? Eddie Reynoso just may be that guy. But he cannot allow himself to make the same mistake he did, you know, by losing a fight simply and not giving your trainer an, an another chance to build you back up, to get you back to where you belong. So, you know, if he goes to Eddie Reynoso, he has to be loyal. I mean, look at Canelo Alvarez, who lost to Floyd Mayweather, and yet he's still stuck with Eddie Reynoso throughout the duration of his career. This guy doesn't change. Loyalty means a lot to these guys. And so Andy Reeves is going to have to show that he's a loyal type of fighter and look let's just be honest we saw how good Andrew Reeves Jr. when he has a competent trainer when he's at his best and he you know he became a unified heavyweight champion of the world and that's what he's looking to do now I mean think about it Andy Reeves has just called out Anthony Joshua for a trilogy fight and aside from calling out Anthony Joshua he called out Tyson Fury as well for another fight so you know he's looking to fight champions he's saying he want to fight these guys he's not even going to be competitive in those fights unless he gets someone that can bring the best out of him stylistically he's going to need someone that can give him a proper game plan Eddie Reynoso is the guy to do it we don't know how good Andy Reese can be but we understand that he has elite level hand speed we understand that his footwork needs some help but we also understand that he's a good boxer with a good IQ he's a top 10 level heavyweight in the world so we understand that Andy Reese at his very best he's a very competent and brilliant fighter and he needs a guy like Eddie Reynoso to bring out the best in him this foot this move needs to happen once again unbiased as always just the ibfp